Here it goes! You should join us, Kakarot. Think of the battles you'll have. Isn't your Saiyan blood boiling with excitement from the thought? Shut up! If you think I'd ever join you, then you're dumber than you look! I can't help but wonder. That child behind you, is that your son? He... he's not! Yes, that boy indeed has Saiyan blood. It's no use trying to hide it from me. I could see his tail from here. So what if he does? You know, perhaps you need a little time to decide. I'll just borrow your son for a while so you can think over my offer. Take one step closer to Gohan and I'll knock you out! Back off! What's that? If you want your little brat, return safely, Kakarot. Prove your Saiyan spirit. Eliminate 100 Earthlings and pile them here before I return in one day. And let me be very clear about this. If I come back and I don't see 100 corpses, I kill the kid. Piccolo? What? What are you doing here? I was pursuing him. And as much as I'd like to kill the wretch myself, the sad truth is I have a better shot at that. If you were along for the ride. Hold on. You mean team up with me? Why in the world would you ever do that? Don't get the wrong idea. This would just be a temporary alliance, only for the sake of eradicating that alien off my planet. Once that purpose has been served, I'll keep my promise to crush you. And then I can get back to my plans of world domination. <sighs> Whatever you say. Goku, watch yourself and keep calm. We all know you can do this. Let me come with you. The three of us together could whip that guy easy. Sorry, Krillin, but you've already been brought back to life by Shenron once before. If anything were to happen to you now, you'd be gone for good. Maybe so, but don't let yourself get killed, Goku, or we're all dead. Master Roshi's right. Let us back you up if you need it. Krillin. Master Roshi, you're the best. We better head out. Bulma, got the Dragon Raider all working? You bet. I should have realized that was the four-star Dragon Ball on Gohan's hat. All right. It's all or nothing now. Goku, wait! Bulma, let's follow them. Say what? I thought you'd at least be smarter than this. But you have no idea how out of your league you are. You know, believe it or not, battles aren't just about raw strength. 
We'll see how long your strategicness keeps you alive. I'm sorry, brother. I was thinking about my offer, and I've changed my mind. You'd probably just slow the rest of us down. And for betraying the Saiyan race, you will die! Since you're going to be eradicated anyway, let me share a little something with you. The two Saiyans I mentioned earlier, they're even more powerful than me. <laughs> you could train yourself for a lifetime and never even come close to their level. But since you were too stupid to heed my warning, you're not going to survive another day anyhow! <laughs> Considering how you managed to beat me last time, I want to see if you've gotten any tougher. So don't you disappoint me. Got it, Goku? Piccolo! If you've got a new special attack hidden up your sleeve, now's the time to use it, Goku. <laughs> Sorry, nope. <laughs> Lazy fool. Meanwhile, I've been training non-stop to develop a sure kill technique. <clears throat> so you've been developing a new technique too? Just when I thought I might have closed the gap between us. What the? Power level 1307? Okay, I'll leave Gohan's training to you. Goku, are you nuts? I know, the old Piccolo was once our greatest enemy, but this one? After what happened today, I think we can trust him. Know what I mean? He's right. If it wasn't for Piccolo, we'd all be dead. And we've got a mutual enemy, so we could use all the help we can get. Gohan, what do you want to do? Piccolo is an amazing fighter, and if you ask me, I think he might actually be a good guy. Well, I... I want to be strong like you, Dad. So I'll do it. I'll learn how to fight with Mr. Piccolo. Well, if you're that eager, then there's no time like the present. Teach him everything you know, Piccolo. You guys have been training hard, huh? You bet. Gotta do our best to catch up with you. I finally finished developing that technique I was teasing before. Can't wait to show you. We're treating today's training as serious as the real battle to come. And we'll showcase all we've learned in preparation. How should we proceed, Goku? Yamcha! You game to train with me? 
Totally. Better give me all you got, Goku, because I can tell if you're holding back. Yep, that's the plan. I might actually have a shot at beating you, but you're stronger than ever. Should have figured. I'll be killing Kakarot first! Don't get cocky because you defeated Raditz! I'm twice as powerful as that runt! I 
Vegeta. Help me! I have no use for a paralyzed Saiyan. Why would you kill your own partner? <laughs> because I wouldn't be caught dead associating with someone who would be taken down by such low-class warriors. You really get on my nerves. You ought to show some more respect to others than that. Respect? <laughs> You're a poor excuse for a Saiyan. Yeah. Ah, so you a Namekian. Namekian. Yes, the Namekian people are said to have mysterious hidden abilities. Magical abilities, in fact. I see. You must have been the one who created these Dragon Balls, aren't you? Wouldn't you like to know? Got you! We're settling this right here and now! I'm the Prince of Saiyans! How can he hurt me? Up when Gohan turned into one of these hulking things, but this is a hundred times worse. I finally figured it out. The monster that stomped my grandpa Gohan to death. It smashed up the tournament arena all those years ago. That that was me, wasn't it? I might as well let you know. The power level of a Saiyan when they transformed into a great ape is ten times their normal strength. Crap! Just when I thought you couldn't get any more powerful! Don't give up, Goku! It might look hopeless, but we've survived this far! Krillin? Not just me, bud. Yamcha and Chaozu and Gohan! We're all with you! Krillin, what are you thinking? Why would you bring them all here now? Because it's all or nothing at this point. Plus, I've got a plan, and I need everyone to pull it off. 
Three of us need to hit him with a solar flare! His paralysis is working! Okay, this is our chance, guys! We did it! Guys! We really did it! We actually managed to beat that guy, and we did it together! <laughs> yeah, we did, but I don't have much left in me after all that. He put up a good fight, but we were more than prepared for him. <gasps> the the sand! Don't worry, Gohan. He can't hurt you now. You were the worst enemy we ever faced. But I guess the least we can do is give you a burial. Who's burying whom? Huh? Filthy Namekian! What do you hope to do with such little- mm -hmm. Now! Piccolo! Do it! Special Beam Cannon! I'm begging you. Just let him go. I know it's selfish, but I don't. I don't want him to die. We'll bring Goku back to life with the Dragon Balls, and the next time we meet, you're going down for good.
Vegeta! I didn't expect to face you again so soon. Kakarot! If you've been revived, that means the Dragon Balls really do live up to the rumors. That's good! Listen up, all of you! If you don't want to die, you need to let me use these Dragon Balls to become immortal! <coughs> if you don't believe me, believe this! The Dragon Balls are being sought after by Frieza, the self-proclaimed Emperor of the Universe! F frieza And I can assure you, not a single Earthling could ever match his power! Frieza is considered absolutely invincible! But if I'm granted immortality, I can kill him and spare all your lives! So if you know what's good for you, hand over the Dragon Balls! You, you gotta be kidding me! After what you did to Goku, why would we ever let you make a wish on the Dragon Balls? Yeah, no offense, but I find it hard to believe there's anyone who could be stronger than Goku anyway. Vegeta, even if you're telling the truth, I'm still not gonna let you use the Dragon Balls. And besides, the Earth is ours to defend! <laughs> Fine, then I'll just have to take them by force. Hey guys, if it's okay, could you leave this one to me? You got it. We're counting on you, Goku! Vegeta! I can tell you've gotten even stronger than last time. Am I right? Naturally. You see, every time Saiyans recover from the brink of death, they grow more and more powerful. So don't even think this is going to go the same way as last time. <laughs> I'm not dumb enough to underestimate you like that. If anything, I was going to say the exact same thing to you. Silence! I'm no ordinary Saiyan. I'm the prince of all Saiyans. Leagues upon leagues ahead of you. I'm not dumb. Yeah, yeah. Kakarot, what would you say to forming a temporary alliance with me to defeat Frieza? An alliance? It will still take some time before Frieza arrives on your planet. If the two of us train until then, we might be able to take him down together. Hold on. If this Frieza person is aiming to attack Earth, then how did you manage to get here before him? Frieza travels in a gargantuan mothership, so my more compact space pod allow me to land here much quicker. None of this changes the fact that we can't trust you. Guys, I think Vegeta's actually telling us the truth. I don't think he'd ever sacrifice his pride as a Saiyan warrior to lie about somebody being stronger than him. I don't know, just doesn't make sense to me. If anything, I think he'd much sooner die trying to steal the Dragon Balls than sacrifice his pride. Th then there really is someone stronger than you and Vegeta? And they want to conquer Earth? I believe you. And I think we have no other choice but to join forces.
So, which one of you wants to die next? Don't start getting a swollen head just because you beat Queen, Vachita! Dodori, hands are on! I might have known you'd show your sorry faces. You're even more foolish than I thought, Vegeta. Did you think teaming up with these Earthlings would put you on equal footing with Frieza? <laughs> then you're as foolish as I thought if you think I'd be relying on Earthlings. Wait. I recall Lord Frieza saying something about a Saiyan survivor that had been sent to the distant blue planet Earth. A Saiyan who was raised on Earth? That'd be me. <laughs> a couple of monkeys flocking together. If the Saiyan race couldn't survive a little meteor, what makes you think you could survive against us? <laughs> Let's just make the last two idiots go extinct! Oh, fine. Since you can't finish the job, allow me. Get ready to see my real strength. Your energy with me. For a spirit bomb. Frieza must be informed of this at once. You won't even get the chance! First blood is mine to draw. Remember, Guldo, orders were to only kill one of them each. Don't get greedy. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Hi. I'll give you one last chance to leave this planet peacefully. I'd take it if I were you. What did you say? Ha <laughs> ha! What a gentleman this guy is, Guldo. Caring about your well-being. Damn Saiyans for getting their place. I'm gonna show you why the whole galaxy fears the Ginyu Force.
Get ready to see my real strength. Here it goes. Goku, you okay? I've got the little guy taken care of. Hey now, it's bad manners to interrupt somebody's business. What? Oh, yeah. Here it goes. Your energy with me for a spirit bomb. Tougher than I thought. I'll kill you quick. You're not taking another step, Goku. This one will be my opponent. Guess I'll be having the leftovers then. Hey, Raccoon, you owe me another chocolate parfait for being such a team player. in the universe. Being a number two fits you pretty well, though. Shut your face! Boy, are you gonna waste the whole rest of the day on this piss -head? All right, I'm jumping in! Join the party. Get ready to share your energy with me. Your energy with me for a spirit bomb. Your energy with me 
for a spirit bomb! This is absurd! The Ginyu Force is unstoppable! Unstoppable, I tell you! Now I can know how strong Vegeta truly is, with a first-hand experience! V Vegeta? What do you think you're doing?! Oh, Ginyu, before exterminating the Earthlings, you should take care of that other Saiyan first. Yes, my lord. That's... Ginyu? W what the hell's going on? Is Vegeta betraying us or what? I'm not sure, but we have to keep on fighting, or we're toast! swap bodies with another. Vegeta's strength is mine to wield! Pardon me, Captain Ginyu. Have you forgotten my orders to obtain the Dragon Balls? No, of course not, Lord Frieza. But I haven't yet located. But, but why? Even using Vegeta's body, why can't I kill you? choice then. I'll just take your body instead! Change now! Kakarot, get out of the way! Whoa. <laughs> I knew you'd use your power again soon enough. You've outlived your usefulness, Vegeta! I'll wind up with a lower power level. But desperate times call for desperate measures. Change now! Stop! You froze for a second. What happened? That technique. It must be. Chotsu!
You wish to do battle with me one-on-one? -on -one? <laughs> I have never encountered such an overconfident imbecile in my whole life. <laughs> I'll let you in on something, Kakarot. Frieza's race can transform to become stronger. Well, someone's done his homework, hasn't he? So you know my little secret? Let's just say some of your elite soldiers have loose lips. He can transform? You mean like that great ape stunt you pulled? You mustn't put me in the same league as your hideous transformation. In my case, I'm merely holding back the full force of my awesome power. If that's the case, go ahead and transform. I wouldn't want you to feel the shame of being defeated without being at your full strength. Oh, you're going to suffer dearly for such an insult. Rejoice. You will have the honor of being killed by my transformed state. Now, feast your eyes! What incredible energy! His power is practically doubled! You're in for it now. My second form makes the one you're familiar with look as gentle as a sleeping kitten. Longer than I wanted. Vegeta! <laughs> Are you afraid? Have you realized that even combined, your power pales in comparison to mine? Kakarot, even you wouldn't be stupid enough to fight Frieza if you didn't think you had a chance of winning. Yeah, that's right. If I use my spirit bomb technique, I think I can beat him. But even then, it's got such a slim chance of working. Gathering enough energy for it takes more time than we have. What? Th what the hell are you going to do? I'm not risking the others' lives in this battle. So if we don't have an opening, I'm just gonna have to make one. Idiot. It's a futile effort. Neither you nor I have any chance of beating him. How can a low-class warrior like you ever hope to topple Frieza? Yeah! <laughs> 
This may steal it. It's been amusing, but I've grown tired of this charade. So I believe it's time to end this poor excuse for a battle. And my reward to you for all your valiant efforts. The privilege of seeing my final transformation. My true power! Now get ready! The wait is over. Now I will show you a terror far greater than hell itself. What are you waiting for? Eat that last sensu bean and be quick about it! I'll send it! The cheetah! But... but what about... Just eat the damn thing before I burn it to the ashes with the last of my strength! Forgive me! Vegeta! No, shut up! You're far more wounded than I am! Don't start giving me your worthless sympathy! You're not like any Saiyan I've ever met in my entire life! Warrior who fights to protect people they care about! Such a nature was frowned upon in our culture! Vegeta! You still don't understand what it means to be a Saiyan! So now I'll set the example! You'll never learn when it's time to lay down and die, will you? Vegeta! It sucks that the biggest drawback to making a strong enough spirit bomb is how long it takes to gather the energy for it. Vegeta may not last long against Frieza. Please, Goku. Take my energy as well. K Kami? <laughs> What's this? Is that what I think it is? I've never seen a mass of energy that size. <laughs> How unfortunate for you. Don't you hate it when a plan falls apart? I know I certainly do, but nice try. No! No, damn it! Special beam, get on! Gohan! Piccolo! What are you doing here? How is that brat? And that Namekian still drawing breath? I thought they'd been taken care of! I'm beset on all sides by sneaky, parasitic flies! You just won't rest until I've been pushed to the limits of my patience! You meddling brats! I hope you all enjoy suffering the same fate as this planet! <sighs> okay, it's finally ready! Do it! Go, go! go! <laughs> what have you done?!
This is where our alliance ends, Kakarot. I will no longer be fighting alongside you people. And mark my words, one day soon, I will defeat you. Seriously? Ugh, I was this close to inviting him to the victory party, too. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe he'll show up when the party starts. I think we're growing on him. Actually, the next time we see Vegeta, I think he'll be intending to fight us for real. What? And like you said, who knows? Don't scare me like that, Goku. <laughs> At the very least, Frieza and his army won't be a threat to Earth anymore. Yeah, and if Vegeta does come back, I doubt it'll be anytime soon. Yeah. Well, I don't know about you guys, but I'm totally starving. Thanks to the bravery of Goku and the others, Frieza is defeated. The planet Earth and the whole galaxy are at peace for now. The war was won, but the battles are far from over, for there are many other fearsome foes looming on the horizon. For Goku and the rest of our heroes, the saga continues.